G'day guys, how are you? So this morning song that's in my head is brought on because I finished watching The Marvelous Mrs. Maisel last week and at the end there was a cover version of Girls Talk by Dave Edmonds but it was done by um, two girls called Tegan and Sarah and that version is what's going through my head, Girls Talk. I heard you mention my name, can't you talk any louder? Now, The Marvellous Mrs. Maisel. Now that started off pretty good, I really liked that. But that last season, they should have ended it the season before. That last season was kind of all over the shop. Because they had to show how she became famous, I guess. But yeah, I, I don't think they needed the last season. The other show that my hubby and I finished watching last week after <laughs> a few years of waiting for each season to come out was uh, Manifest on Netflix. Uh, Mrs. Maisel was on Amazon Prime if you wanted to watch that. Um, I Going back to Mrs. Maisel, I love Mrs. Maisel because it's set in the 50s and 60s and I just loved the clothes that that girl wore. She looked amazing. It was amazing. Losing blood in my arm. Um, anyway, Manifest, of course, is the one about the people that take a flight and it comes, lands five years later, but they, to them, it's just been a flight and it's landed. And they've got no idea that they've been missing for five years. So, yeah. Anyway, that finally finished. Now, I put that on my Facebook that we'd finished it and so many people said, oh, it lost me. It lost me. <laughs> and I was like... Go back, start again and watch it um, because it all kind of comes together and the last episode is pretty good actually. I actually cried in the last episode, but yeah. Um, so yeah, Manifest Manifest and Mrs. Maisel, two shows are finally finished. Um, on top of, of course, watching all the Brady Match. You must think I watch a lot of TV. I suppose I do, but... Um, uh, I, I knit stuff for homeless people. So I don't just sit there and watch TV. I'm actually knitting and doing something with my hands because I can't just sit and watch TV. I have, to, I have to do something with my hands because I have ADHD. Anywho, so yeah, I do knit stuff for homeless people. So um, a lady that I give it to <coughs> who distributes it, she got a call from someone to say, oh, I've got all this wool. I can't use it because I have arthritis. So this lady... Uh, messaged me and said do you want all this wool I was like yeah that'd be great anyway it was like a if you think of a laundry hamper a tall laundry hamper it was full chockers squished in chockers full of wool anyway I've got three balls left I've made quite a few scarves out of all of that um, I did scarves because it's that chenille wool that's a, which doesn't really hold well in a beanie it's not kind of stiff enough so I just made scarves. Anyway, I'm just about finished all that wool and then I've got no wool left. So hopefully, uh, rarely do I buy wool. Usually it just kind of comes from somewhere. Someone donates it. We have a buy nothing page in our area um, and the amount of wool people give away on there and they give it to me. So that's nice. Um, yeah, so that that's why I seem to watch a lot of TV. Um, I'm losing blood in that hand now um, because I knit while I while I uh, watch all the TV. But Girls Talk, which was, like I said, was originally done by Dave Edmonds in 1979. I thought that was a, like a 1950s, 60s song. No, 1979. There you go. Anyhow, have a great day, guys. See ya.